Sabina's one of the few professional models out there not afraid to rock the tattoos. What is up, girl? Hi. She's also my friend. How you doing? Good, nice to see you. Good to see you, too. How was your drive from uh, Vegas? Uh, it was long. Really? But, yeah, it wasn't too bad. Sure. <laughs> Thank you. She's always cute. Oh. So, um, what are you doing on you? I want to do a, a monster head pinup. Cool. Not exactly like this. Yeah. I kind of want to let you. Reference. Yeah. I'll make it look hotter. Cool. Thank cool. you. Cool. <laughs> Today I got to tattoo Sabina. I was pretty stoked. We know each other from just like the whole tattoo scene and stuff. And she always comes out to like tattoo conventions. So it was really cool to tattoo her. I want a banner underneath her that uh -huh. says Beauty Queen. Oh, nice. And pretty much leave it up to you. I want it like traditional pinup uh -huh. looking. So where are you going to put her at? I want to put it right here. I want to finish this arm. Okay. Right so I'm going to draw. Out. It's gonna take me like five minutes. Okay, and then, cool. uh, you wanna hang out right there? Sure. And, uh, and then I'll call you over. All right. The design I brought in for Kat was a picture of pinup head, like the old 40s glamour pinup heads. Kind of monster looking or dead looking. I wanted to get this tattoo and keep myself true to being a good person inside and out and be beautiful inside and out. It's time for me to go to work on Sabina. <laughs> Kat Bondi reporting for duty. <laughs> So I'm gonna put a stencil on you. Okay. Does your husband do most of your tattoos? Um, he did this arm. Most okay, of this arm. that's a great. You want to tattoo Sabina? It was kind of nerve-wracking. Her husband is probably one of the best tattooers you can find in Vegas. Sabina has both of her arms tattooed with these beautiful, bright colored tattoos that her husband did, and it's pretty easy to uh, be a little bit self-conscious of what I'm doing when I have that in front of me. Here we go. I like the whole concept of it being beauty queen, and it's like, mm -hmm. you know, still like she's <laughs> a monster girl. Yeah, so she's like a monster. Because I think like a lot of people like look at girls like us that are heavily tattooed and portrayed in that stigma. It's like we can still be beauty queens and all that right, stuff without exactly. conforming to like the regular. You know, mm -hmm. Is that why you wanted to get this. Yeah, that and to remind me to stay true to myself and not turn into some of those catty girls that, sure, that you know, themselves. yeah, they're, you know, they're beautiful on the outside, but then they're a horrible person. And it's like beauty is inside and out. Having tattoos in the modeling industry is really hard. There's not a lot of models that are heavily tattooed, but it's a part of me and it kind of makes me a rarity. And it's funny because for a long time I just had one arm sleeve. Yeah. And every photographer was like, do not do your other arm because I could always fake that I had no tattoos yeah, by, you, you know, posing. It. Yeah, so as soon as I did my other arm, everyone was like horrified. Like, and oh and my you were God. like, it was probably a big step, I'm sure. You're it like... was a big step, but you know what? It's cool. I'm not going to like let, you know, not get tattooed just because, yeah. oh, I couldn't model or, you know, whatever. You ready to check it out? Yeah. Oh, Oh, it's amazing. My finished tattoo is absolutely incredible. The colors are beautiful. The one thing I was kind of unsure about writing, like putting the writing in there, but the way she did it was just perfect. I was really thrilled by it, and I had so much fun with her. Yeah, it looks so good. Oh, you thank love you. It? I love it. Oh. <laughs>